in Wayne County for this one, what could be a final farewell to a popular business over in Livonia. We're talking about Aurie's Bakery, which has put a lot of smiles on a lot of faces over the years, but there are fewer tonight. As the company announces, it is on the edge of closing for good. Local 4 business editor Rob Maloney tells us about this bakery's fight to stay in business. When you're around for more than a century, you're good at some things, obviously. Ari's used to be known for their windmill cookies, and that's on the sign out here in front of the plant. But these days, it's the Long John coffee cake and also the shortbread date nut bars. But sadly, all of this may be going away for good. The Ari's food label says it best, baking your day sweeter since 1910. Yet in a letter to the state last week, the company announced it's getting ready to lay off its 63 employees and close. Drone 4 gives us a bird's eye view of this massive plant. Yes, it is a bakery, but one of the largest in the Midwest at more than 218,000 square feet using four industrial continuous feed ovens. It churns out case after case of beloved ripple cakes, cookies and cornbread daily. The assembly line humming these days also with cookies, a granola drop, cheese, Danish and biscuits. Longtime customer John Cortez appreciates the thrift store. 100% quality. They're, they're great. I've been going here for years and years and years. The prices, you can't beat them. Rudy Cardenas came in to supply Bill Brown Ford with pastry. You always like to do business with people you work, live around and work around. The company tells local for the pandemic. Suppliers hiking food prices, spiking container and packaging costs hurt the company dearly, along with the fact that people just don't eat sweets like they used to. Still, the company's been through this before. Back in 2013, they were ready to auction off the equipment when buyer Ron Beebe of Midland and Minnie Marie Bakers snapped up the Ari's plant minutes before the bankruptcy foreclosure auction deadline. It is very sad. Uh, you hope it co they come out of this. They, they survived the last time. Hopefully they'll survive this time. Are you hoping that somebody comes in and buys them out? Yes, absolutely. I wish it could be me. Maybe I'll win the, the mega this week yeah. and I'll, I'll buy it. <laughs> well, with John's lottery win notwithstanding, it is going to be a tall order to get somebody to come in and take over the Ari's plant because they're going to need to bring in their own volume to make their own product in order to be able to turn a profit. It's so big in here. Tall order has been done before, so there is that possibility that somebody could come in here. But if not, they say they're going to close by the end of September. In Livonia, Rod Maloney, Local 4. And a company statement owner, Rod Beebe, said, it's been a privilege and honor to provide the iconic brand of high quality baked goods. And thanks everyone from the employees to vendors to customers for their business.